Hi friends, I have no idea of what to expect except I guess we're fighting the end boss. Good times and cutscene, of course. Oh, me boy, did you just get punched in the face? <laughs> Are we finally having this face off? I guess, didn't we face him in the first world as well? That was so long ago. Wow, well that was decisive. <laughs> I think he's dead. Oh, it's okay. It's because he responds. <laughs> I love the missile sound effect as well. Okay, this is going to be something. <laughs> oh, I'm kind of terrified. The end boss. The boss for the end, because it's the end. What do you do? Um, okay, well, we have moving things. Oh, and you are shooting at me. But this is pretty safe so far. <laughs> I gotta say, now it's kind of... Well, I mean, it's just going to be light world difficulty, right? And I've been dealing with much worse than that lately, so... Yeah, well, I don't have anything to worry about. Where do I go from here? I think I need to... What do I go? Um, well, it stopped, so that's good, because otherwise I wasn't going to have time to pull out that trick. Oh, and now it's going again. Was it waiting for me, or was it on a timer? Oh, can you make that jump, please, Meepoy? Don't... Dang it, really? I just died it in that ridiculous way. I'm not worried about this level, I gotta say. So far, this just looks like fun. Hi, I'm just gonna let you shoot at me because it's safer than dodging all the saw blades. At least for that long. <laughs> and now we proceed. Oh, that. Oh, that's actually a dangerous jump. Right up the wall there. Are you? He's just so cute. <laughs> the little guy. Oh, he jumps and then he shoots. Okay. I think. Here we go. Perfect timing. Oh, except I wanted to get one fewer cycle on that, but it worked out. Except that I jumped like a stupid. This level's easy, I promise. I shouldn't be dying. Maybe I'll stand a little bit closer so I can see what you do. Okay. Whoa! It's one of those missiles that can do a crazy turning around thing. That seems super unfair to me. Okay, do your move. And then, yep, yeah, I'll just let it explode someplace. Oh, that was a bit of a danger jump. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't think I can race this single saw blade, but it doesn't matter. We It all worked out. Whoa, dang it! I was going too fast! Isn't that always the way? Okay, this is easy. I probably... <laughs> Seriously. Ooh, nice. Sliding up the wall to give myself time to dodge the missile. Oh I, oh, I maybe could have raced the thing. I just want to go faster. And I can't really. <laughs> so I'm even waiting here. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> it's a level um, intentionally trying to make me go slowly? That doesn't seem right. Oh, I see the guy. He's following me. Oh, what the... Why would I do that? Uh, I'm super smart is why, of course. And good at video games. All the video games, all the time. He is very slow with his pursuit. Oh, I did that! <laughs> Let's not do it again, though. <laughs> Was not worth it, because I still have to wait around here for that stuff to get out of my way. Then I jump to this platform and wait some more, and then I jump to this wall and wait some more because there are saw blades that want to kill me, and then I jump to here. And now we make progress again. Good. And I'm going to not jump into any obstacles like the ridiculous person. Hi, this is crazy. I guess I should go over that, <laughs> maybe. Um, wow. The, it's, just, it's just a lot of saw blades everywhere. It's not really what I was expecting from Final Boss, I gotta say, but I don't mind, because it's... I mean, it's Meepo and saw blades. That's, like, his greatest enemy. It's certainly not Dr. Fetus. He's not a me boy's great, he's just there. He's just for storyline. But it's all the deadly saw blades. I wonder what's gonna happen when we reach the end of the level and he's following me still. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go over here like this. Clearly the right thing to do. And then I'm going to react correctly next time because um, reacting correctly is clearly the right thing to do as well. I'm glad your shots are so easy to dodge, Mr. Man. I'm not worried about your danger. Um, I don't think you have any danger in you. Okay, here we go. Making the jumps. I wish I could just jump to that left wall, but I can't. <laughs> it actually functions as a wall, just to bar my way. How dare you, game. And then, yeah, it's just it's the only reason I have to take my time for that part. And um, I could do that better than I do. So I want to fall to the left, not all the way down. But I get stuck on the wall. In case you haven't noticed, that wall is a genuine obstacle, as it turns out. What the heck killed me? <laughs> Did the missile kill me? And I looked away. 
That's the only thing that... No, I died again! Am I glitching into the wall? I'm gonna try it one more time, see what happens. Jump your missile. No, well, okay. I guess I'll continue since, since it's just at the beginning of the level. I'm not, I don't have to be worried about that glitch. Oops, going a little too slowly here. That was dangerous. Most dangerous part I'm going to encounter. This level's kind of boring. <laughs> Compared to some of the great levels I've been encountering lately, this is, yeah, it's just sit around and wait and dodge a couple of saw blades that shouldn't be hard to dodge, but of course I'm super good at all video games all the time. There, see? Easiest thing ever! <laughs> Seriously! <laughs> and yep, carry on, I just want to walk off this to here, and do some jumping that won't get me killed even once, somehow. No, that was almost a disaster. I mean, I made that jump. Where else to go? Oh, is this going to be a Mario reference with Bowser? I have this step on the button to make the Dr. Fetus fall into the pit. Where is he? Oh, there's a button up there. I see it. <laughs> Whoa, hello. Oh, I missed it. Um, am I dead now because I missed that? Sure am. Okay, well, we learned something at least. <laughs> now this time we're really going to win. Um, just in case his missile was the thing killing me, I'm gonna try to time it a bit more dangerously so it goes under me instead of sticking in the wall. I don't know why that would happen kind of missile physics would have it stick in a wall and then kill me after it's clearly exploded. But, you know, Super Meat Boy. <laughs> it does weird things sometimes. <laughs> uh, there was that one level where I glitched through the wall to the end and got a ridiculously fast time, so much so that I replayed the level. This is like in the first or second video. <laughs> um, I happen to remember, maybe it wasn't. It might have been World 2, actually, so that would have put it in like the third or fourth video. You know, fourth or fifth. How many videos have there been of this game? <laughs> a lot! I've been playing this game for a really long time, and it's about time I actually finished. But there's still another world! So, actually no on that. So I need to go down. Oh, hello! Wasn't expecting that. Okay, hit the thing, hit the thing, and then go down. Nope, that's death. I didn't think so. So... Do I need to actually lead this guy all the way so I can drop him in the pit? So am I going too fast? I don't think so. That doesn't make any sense, do we? Whoa! Jump, me boy! Come on! I'm doing something wrong, though. How do I avoid those saw blades at the end? Yeah, it is the missile killing me, I think. Oh, so maybe I shouldn't stick to the wall. Let's try that. Simple fix. So. Can I get this guy to actually follow me? I wouldn't know how. I mean, he's just doing his own thing. I can't. He's not, I don't think he's influenced by my actions at all. I don't understand. <laughs> I mean, clearly it's a Mario reference. This, this, um, the bridge that you drop the enemy into. Bowser, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Um, oh, get off the wall, me boy. <laughs> so dangerous. Maybe I should, when it stalls there, maybe I should just wait for the guy. But it might be on a timer, so it might not be waiting for me to make progress. Oh, really? I just did that? Well, let's try it this next time. Um, next time it stalls, I'm not going to make progress. I'm just going to stand somewhere and wait. Yeah, I think the missile explosion was lingering longer than I thought it would. Uh, also, I didn't think it would kill me. <laughs> All I mean, it's just an explosion. Explosions are perfectly safe every time. I know what you're talking about. Uh, it certainly couldn't hurt the meat boy. So I'm going to jump to this platform. No, I'm going to use this platform. And wait, nope. I maybe should have tried the, or the back platform. I didn't want to, if, if it doesn't wait for me, then I, I didn't want it to, ah, leave without me. Like it sort of is doing. Yep, I know him. No, I think it's on a timer. Okay. So waiting, ugh, waiting at these points for the enemy guy to join me, um, not gonna work. So what's going on? <laughs> what's going wrong here? It's possible that my game is just not behaving correctly because my game does that. It does seem like he's going way slower than he should be, um, but he's just not a threat in the whole level and what's the point of that? I thought maybe he, we would meet up in the end of the level, but I don't think that's what's happening. So, 
I don't have any. Oops. Nah, that part's really hard. <laughs> the only hard part on the level, I think. Everything else that keeps killing me, it's just ridiculous. Okay, what do I do with you, sir? I can't stand around and wait because I'm going to die here if I do. So, hurry up. But, seriously. He's not even here. Oh, now he's moving. Um, man, it's possible that he's not behaving correctly the way he's supposed to because of my silly computer. Um, I may play it one time without recording to see if it behaves any differently. Oh, dang it! Um, but I'm not, I haven't gotten to that point yet because it could be I'm missing something at the end of the level. And so I'm going to keep trying things. I mean, I just only one time made the buttons work the way they're supposed to. So, so let's not start assuming the game's at fault yet. Yeah, because I'm not, for being a really easy, boring level, I'm not doing super great. I gotta say, what does that say about me? It means I'm pretty boring myself, I could say. Um, he's following me, though. So it's, it's gotta be something with him. Otherwise he wouldn't be doing that, right? I don't know. But he's so slow. Why would he be this slow? Okay, let's not die in any ridiculous ways. We've dealt with obstacles way worse than that. Okay, it, it might be possible to get below these saw blades, but I don't think it'd be possible to survive long term, and I wouldn't be able to get back up. Yeah, I think something's not working. Let me try... well... I don't know. I don't know. And of course the level's designed in such a way that it's impossible to get around all of these saw blades, isn't it? Maybe if I hang out down here, I don't think I could quite make that jump. Oh, but that wall might be low enough. Let me try that. I'm just trying to cheat the game now. Just down here. So that the saw blades get ahead of me. Nope, I <laughs> mistimed it. There's just not much room to jump there. If I had a different character, I could try using... Um, what's his name? Commander Video? Is that his name? Um, with his hover. That might that might give me the, uh, the time I need to avoid that thing. Or um, the head crab might even be better. I don't know if he can make it that far. Because <laughs> he doesn't play very well, but yeah, I don't know. <laughs> he just sticks to walls so well. Um, I don't remember anybody else, but I think between those two, it's got to be possible. I, wish, I, wish, I just wish it was clear what I was trying to accomplish. See, he seems to be moving quickly now. Uh, I don't know, I'm going to try this again. Oh, crap. <laughs> I'm going to try this a few more times. There we go. Okay, that's a thing I just did. <laughs> now make progress, thank you. Confirms it's on a timer, at least. And I see the guy behind me. Um, now I really don't want to die in ridiculous ways, if you don't mind, game. I think he just shot a missile at me. So, I'm just going to go to the end and wait, right? <laughs> <laughs> I think the hardest part of this whole level is cheating the game. Um, but like I say, I don't think it's behaving correctly. Oh, this it's probably going to come back to me, isn't it? This, I was just going to go up there for no reason. Um, I kind of want to see where the guy is. But yeah, the saw blades, are, I think they do that in this game. They go on a reverse course. Where is he? Oh, dang it. I <laughs> stopped jumping. <laughs> well, it's okay. We can do that again. <laughs> looks so impossible every time. <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay, I kind of want to keep a better eye on the guy, though. Where is he? Well, he's shooting at me. Does that mean he's stopped? Nope, he's making progress. You can do it, guy! Come on! Come on! We got this together. Oops! Ah, dang it.
there we go, finding out this stupid jump. But I can't see the guy. I want to see him. Are you still following me, sir? I hope so. Just taking your sweet time. I just feel like he's supposed to be keeping up with the saw blades and keeping up with me. He's supposed to be another obstacle to deal with. And he's lagging behind because my game runs strangely. <laughs> so, I mean, that's, that's my interpretation right now. So this is going to be a very unique... Oh, that was almost horrible. Oh, man. Very unique to me experience here. <laughs> um, oh, he's going through the saw blades now. You're weird, yeah. You're weird. Okay, let's do this thing. What do you say? You, well, oh my. Now he's gonna kill me, though. Oh, and I missed the thing because, oh, I didn't, yeah. Uh, get the thing. Get the other thing. Die, please. Yeah, see? Conclusion drawn. <laughs> my game is strange. Oh, I didn't want to kill the guy. Go save him, meat boy, because you're the hero. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of pathetic, I get it. Can't do anything with this soup without his super suit. Oh, we died! <laughs> oh, game! Oh, this game is so twisted. It's because Ed McMillan is pretty twisted. But, it's okay. I still think it's great fun. Uh-oh! Four times! <laughs> we're, all, we're all in trouble. You, oh, oh, Meat Boy, what are you gonna do? Oh, why isn't Bandage Girl the one doing the rescuing? Oh, it's not over! Why, game? Why would you? Why would you? Of course I have to do this in reverse. Oh, but fortunately, I don't have to do the first level. <laughs> the first half, the whatever. Um, again. That's a horrible jump. Am I doing that wrong? Um, okay, so this is just fun. <laughs> I was worried that I was gonna have to do the whole thing again. But no, now we're just having an escape sequence. Just enjoying our time. That's a horrible jump! <laughs> enjoying our time, except for the horrible jump that I've never made it past, and I don't even know what else I'm going to have to do. So, yeah, but I love, love the sprite work here <laughs> with Bandage Girl. I do still wish she was saving Meat Boy. That would have been, that would have been nice. Isn't that, that's sort of how the original Meat Boy ends, isn't it? Bandage Girl saves Meat Boy in the end? I believe so. Um, but, I don't know. <laughs> don't, don't, don't quote me. I don't know anything often, as I'm sure you are well aware. Where do I go from here? Delaware? That's a place. Strange, I'm sorry. <laughs> strange person playing a strange game, what can I say? Okay, so, trying to get it over that guy and the rest... Trying to get over that guy and then the rest should be easy, even if I kill myself in ridiculous ways. Oh, what? Well, really? Jumped right into it. What's that weird explosion that keeps appearing? Is, I, don't, I don't know. Is that supposed to be doing what it's doing? Um, I, I would like to see what this level's supposed to be like. I may go back and watch Cow Cow, finally. <laughs> Just this one level to see. Um, <laughs> Dr. Fetus fight. I keep wanting to call him Dr. Eggman, which I'm sure is intentional. Um, dang it, no, oh, come on. I was fine. Just kind of blind drops there. I'm not actually sure where I'm aiming. Uh, where I'm supposed to be aiming, rather. <laughs> um, yeah, but just to see what actually, what is actually supposed to be like, because clearly that was not the intended. <laughs> it's a good, it's a good sort of. I mean, it's it summarizes a lot of my experience with this game. Seriously, um, this whole video has. <laughs> but we were, this isn't it. Where I mean, there's still one more world to go. Fun times. <laughs> I can't even imagine. How awful it's all going to be. <laughs> I do love this game. I don't know. It's just it's such good game design. And that's what I care about. <laughs> I am a snob. Okay, drop to here. Perfectly safe. I can see there's a platform there because there's a saw blade there. See? Oh, I hate these jumps though. It's okay. I didn't even die to it once. And now I need to do a crazy jump there. Sure. 
Oh, I just realized there is no bandage girl at the end of this level because I already have her with me. So how is this level going to end? Oh, I hate these jumps. Dang it, say why? <sighs> okay. Yeah, how is this level going to end? We're just escaping together, finally? I mean, it's a nice way to end the whole game, really, if you think about it. You know, trying to get her this whole time, and every time I reach her, she's whisked away by some evil doctor man. Um, but this time, finally, the evil doctor man couldn't do it, so now I actually have her and I need to escape. I like it. I'm a fan. At least as long as I can do it, I'm a fan. <laughs> if it's horribly impossible, we'll see. Okay. Horrible jumps. Horrible jumps. I don't have a time limit, I'm pretty sure. I don't have to worry about time limits on these sorts of levels. And there! That was the end! Hello! <laughs> Maybe she'll rescue him now in the cutscene. That would be nice. You better run, me boy! Oh, oh, uh, why didn't you just run? I don't understand. Huh? She was happy about something. That's not what I was expecting. It looked like she was happy about something, like she spotted... Oh, I guess she spotted that guy. Okay, I don't remember who you are, but you are a guy, so thanks. Thanks, <laughs> yes, thumbs up. Yeah, he's time to run, thank you. <laughs> there you go. Don't be ridiculous. He's fine, me point. Don't worry about it. He'll just respawn. Everything's good. <laughs> oh, what a noble sacrifice, I guess, from the guy who I don't remember. It's very touching. Very touching. Wow, that was some serious music. Is it over? <laughs> They're so cute. Is that the whole world exploding? Or just the level? It's kind of big to just be that one level. I think that's all of World 6 exploding. That's that's my conclusion. That's what I'm going with. <laughs> oh, he's still alive, of course. <laughs> what? It's still going, guys! Very important storyline. Yeah, what else? Oh, we get credits! Actual credits! Tommy, that's his, the other guy's name. I don't know how to say his last name. Um, and, and wait, no, of course. <laughs> There's the squirrel! <laughs> okay, from the forest to burn down, sure. Or a squirrel, I guess the squirrel got decapitated or something. Um, here's the guy who did the music, and somebody else did sound effects, I don't even know that. Announcer voice, Wiggly Check. Yeah, it is. Before and after, sure. <laughs> what the weird? It's very, very fitting <laughs> ending to this game. <laughs> I mean, like the credits, and it's just, yes. It's, it's just, yes. Ah, Behemoth and Blink works. If you say so. Oh, Brownie, apparently, was his name. That he's not, he's, he's, he's not dead. Because everybody just respawns in this game. <laughs> but of course, sure, why, of course, I, d what? <laughs> um, okay, okay. More gonna happen? I don't know. Oh, we have Dancing Meat Boy Army. Because that's a thing. <laughs> I don't know what I'm experiencing anymore. <laughs> this game is one of a kind. And let's all be grateful. I guess there is another Meat Boy. There are several other Meat Boys, come to think of it. Never mind. Forget I said anything. Are you a boss at some point? Sure. Why does it say the boss name at the bottom? Like, you know, a Metroid game or a Zelda game. A Mario game! I figured it out! <laughs> like, like a Mario game would do. Uh, <laughs> why Metroid and Zelda? I have no idea. Don't worry about it. I have no idea what any Zelda enemy names are. Because they're all nonsense. Metroid as well. They're all just 
jumbles of letters that make no sense at all. Did we win? Hello? Wide eyes? Okay. <laughs> the end. Find out in the dark world. Uh, I think I've done that already. Yay! <laughs> five out of five! So that's 100%, except I still need to do the glitch world. Um, not today, obviously. I'm trying to go... Yeah, there we go. Cotton Alley? Sure. Yeah, it's not 100% here yet, because I have to do the glitch world. Um, and I don't even know what level I'm gonna use. Probably level 3? Is level 3 the one where you can see bandage grow? I'm not- I'm really not doing it in this video, I just wanna take a- nope, that's not it. Um, maybe 2? No, I need to exit the map. Um, just so I know for next time. Uh, the one where I can see her right at the start. So I can see if she's glitching. That's the one. Okay. So, everybody, this has been Bertrand Earth playing Super Meat Boy, and next time, we'll do the glitch world, and it's probably going to be terrible. Thanks for watching.